Hello and welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question that says A farmer was having a field in the form of a parallelogram PQRS. She took any point A on RS and joined it to points P and Q. In how many parts the field is divided? What are the shapes of these parts? The farmer wants to sow wheat and pulses in equal portions of the field separately. How should she do it? So let's start with the solution. And first let us interpret the given question in the form of a figure. So let this be the field PQRS and a point A is taken on SR and it is joined to the points P and Q. Now the first question is in how many parts the field is divided? So answer to the first part is the field is divided into three parts. The first part is triangle PSA, second part is triangle PAQ and the third part is triangle AQR. Now next we have to answer what are the shapes of these parts. Now as we can see from the figure, the portion 1, portion 2 and portion 3 all are in triangular shapes. Therefore, we can say that each portion has a triangular shape. Now the farmer wants to sow wheat and pulses in equal portions of the field separately. How should she do it? Now as we know, if a triangle and a parallelogram are on the same base and between the same parallel lines Then, area of triangle is equal to half the area of parallelogram. And from the figure we can see that Triangle PAQ and the parallelogram PQRS are on the same base PQ and between the same parallel lines PQ and SR. So this implies area of triangle PQA is equal to half area of parallelogram PQRS. So this implies that area of Triangular portion 1 plus 3 is equal to area of triangular portion 2. Thus, the farmer can sow wheat in triangle APQ and Pulses in other two triangles or pulses in triangle APQ and wheat in the other two triangles.
So this is our answer. And this completes the session. Take care and have a good day.